Hey. Hey. I, um, I heard you took a little tumble. How you doing? You know me, I bounce. <laughs> I'm glad to see your sense of humor didn't take a hit. Just her memory. That psycho Taya Delgado has damaged my niece's brain. Now, John, what is the Landview Police Department going to do about it? It's a menace. They won't get an argument from me. Do you know that she forced her way into the hospital? And when Todd leaves her, she's liable to come back here and try and finish the job. Taya says it's an accident, and the physical evidence seems to support that. So until this young lady can remember something else. Blair cannot remember, and so LPD will just have to build a case without right her. No, there is no case story. Because you let Taya go. Given the evidence, Officer Fish seems to have made the right call. Oh, this is an outrage. Please, once I am mayor, I can tell you the Landview Police Department is going to be held to a new standard of accountability. I can't wait. By the way, congratulations. When's the big day? What? What are you talking? What big day? Um. No, darling, you, this is <laughs> not the right time. Oh. I promise you, if we find evidence contradicting Taya's accounts, we'll reopen the investigation. How's that? Not bad, for now. And if Blair happens to remember what happened, well, that's right at the top of my list. Right now. How about you work on getting out of here first? Whatever you say, Doctor. Mom. I'm tired of seeing you in here. Check in on you soon. Sorry, I thought you were done for the day. What's going on? We're just uh, having a chat. You don't have to cover for me. No, I came here to see if Marty could get you to lay off Jared. But I realize that's a mistake, because when John McBain's always right, even when he's dead wrong. Are you referring to a particular case? Do you still think that Jared's guilty? I have nothing to talk about with you. Natalie? I have to follow the evidence. Even when that evidence is taking you down the wrong path? Exactly. And if Jared's innocent, I'll find that out, too. Well, I won't hold my breath, but I will make sure that Jared gets out of this mess with or without you. Yeah, well, Jared might help himself by telling the truth. Maybe you can convince him to do that. He is telling the truth. No, he's not. And you know it. Sorry about that. No, it's okay. I just wish I could have done more to help her. I'm sure you did everything you could. Yeah, she's pretty hurt and confused. It's clear that you two have pretty strong feelings for each other. I'm not exactly sure what you're saying, but Natalie and I were a long time ago. I yeah, there's still a connection, pretty strong one. Is that your professional opinion, Doc? Come on, look how easily you push each other's buttons. Yeah, well, we have a lot of history. You ready to go? I gotta make one more phone call. I wanna check in on Blair, see what her condition is. Have you, you did here, right? I was over there. Yeah, Cole told me. Taya pushed her out the window? Allegedly. The important thing is, it looks like Blair's gonna be okay. I don't know if I can say the same for Taya. So, um, uh, <clears throat> still wanna grab a bite before we get back to the station, or are there any other exits we need to check in with? Thank you. 